This is the 1990s. Candy of the 90s was whimsical, with fun and colorful packaging and zany ad campaigns. 90s Candies fans will love this list, as it's a blast from the past. Some of these sweet treats are still available, while others have been discontinued. Here are the top 10 best candies of the 90s, part two. Back in the 90s, I was in a very famous TV show called Horsin' Around. Cowtails are chewy caramel treats. Hey, Lisa, I found a big caramel deposit at the small of her back. Cowtails are still sold today, so it's not too late to enjoy this classic 90s candy. While cowtails soared in popularity during the 90s, they've been available since 1984. The candies are slim cylinders of chewy caramel with creamy filling. The company offers cowtails in a range of fun and tasty flavors. The mini candies are the ultimate bite-sized indulgence. Cowtails of all flavors and sizes taste great, and the packaging for cowtails is cute, thanks to a funny cartoon cow. Where will you go now, Mr. Cow? I cannot stay here. Sometimes people forget just how delicious retro candy was. Since it's still possible to buy cowtails and revisit the great caramel and cream flavor all over again, enjoying cowtails will be a perfect way to relive the 90s. Mr. Connery. Mold. Colorful Jawbreakers. Jawbreakers, to me, was like the ultimate challenge candy. Remember Jawbreakers? These round candies feature inner layers of many different colors. When you suck on a Jawbreaker and pull it out of your mouth occasionally, you'll see new colors that make enjoying this sweet, hard candy really fun. Some people can't resist the urge to bite through Jawbreakers as soon as they're able to. One of these dumb kids broke his jaw on a Jawbreaker. Why would you do that? Some Jawbreakers have centers that taste different than the outer layers, and these centers can be extra delicious. Delicious. Some jawbreakers are huge and hard to bite through. Others are small and easy to crunch. Jawbreakers were very popular during the 90s, and certain jawbreaker candy brands, such as Gobstoppers, are still around today. Most convenience stores and candy stores offer jawbreakers. They're a classic retro candy that kids love. Easy to find and generally very affordable, jawbreakers can be long-lasting treats. Lots of different candy companies manufacture jawbreakers, so so consumers have options. I thought a jawbreaker would be funny. Pixie sticks have a timeless appeal. The three of us are lost in a timeless oblivion. Pixie sticks are sugary powder treats that have a fascinating origin story. During the 1940s, a drink mix called Fruzola Jr. was sold, which cost just a penny. Children started eating the drink mix powder right out of its packaging without adding water. The drink mix powder had a sour, sweet taste that kids just couldn't resist. When Fruzola Zola execs realized that kids loved the powder, minus the H2O, a new and glorious candy soon followed. We are gonna be the best thing since sliced bread. Nestle, which owns the Willy Wonka Candy Company, acquired the rights to Pixie Sticks candy way back in the 50s. Today, these candy-filled straws are still available from the Willy Wonka Candy Company. They're easy to find online and may be on sale in your own community, too. Inside of each straw, there's a fruity candy powder. There are varieties packs for sale, which allow Pixie Sticks fans to sample all of the flavors. There are even king-sized candy sticks, which are much larger than the regular-sized Pixie Sticks. We're all out of Pixie Sticks. Hubba Bubba Bubble Tape. How much bubble tape can you handle? This was a classic found around schoolyards, playgrounds, arcades, malls, or wherever kids could be found in the 90s. Chances are you'd also see some Hubba Bubba Bubble Tape hanging around with them. You could spot the packaging by its bright color and signature hockey puck-like shape. Each standard Hubba Bubba Bubble Tape container has six feet, or 1.8 meters, of rolled up bubblegum goodness inside. The gum, and specifically the container, make it great for sharing. Simply pull out the length of gum you want from your or your friend's bubble tape container and snap it shut to slice off the bubble tape at the desired length. That said, it was also great for some stealth bubblegum action, as the same method could be used to discreetly grab yourself a piece of gum at any length at any time. Talk about awesome. You want a piece of me, pal? 
Oh. Hubba Bubba first introduced bubble tape in the late 80s, but it reached its highest heights of popularity during the 90s. The gum is made by the Wrigley Company, who makes a plethora of other products, and this is one of their gum products that was heavily marketed specifically towards preteen kids. We say was because while the candy is certainly still around, the marketing has all but disappeared compared to the 90s. That said, like we just mentioned, Hubba Bubba Bubble Tape is very much still around, and you can find it at basically any grocery store, pharmacy, or dedicated candy shop in your area, so you can easily relive this 90s classic or give it a try for the first time. Six feet of awesome in your face bubble gum. Wonder Ball candy comes with a surprise. No one can resist my sweaty balls. This fun candy was a big hit in the 90s and it's still around these days. It's made by a company called Frankfurt, which has been offering great candy to kids of all ages since 1947. For a while, the Wonder Ball wasn't available, but the team at Frankfurt decided to bring it back. This classic candy is a holiday chocolate ball that's wrapped in foil. Once the chocolate ball is opened, a delicious candy is revealed. Wonder Ball candies also come with exciting stickers that are very child-friendly and fun. Surprises in Wonder Ball candies do vary, and that's part of the fun. There are a trio of Wonder Ball candy types to choose from. There's the original Wonder Ball, which features a candy surprise as well as stickers. There's also a Wonder Ball Plus prize, which has the usual Wonder Ball elements plus an extra prize that's collectible. The third option is Wonder Ball Minis, which are meant to be shared. They come with a couple of smaller Wonder Balls, as well as stickers. The Wonder Ball may remind you of another popular candy called the Kinder Surprise. Surprise! While the Kinder Surprise toys are similar to Wonder Ball candy, there is a difference. The toys inside of the Kinder Surprise candies aren't edible, which is why they're banned in the States. With Wonder Ball candy, kids can eat the candy surprise. Now that Wonder Ball candy is back, 90s kids can enjoy it as they reminisce about the good old days. Remember Bobby's World? It was a good show! Tear jerkers are fruity and sour. Fruit! It has two meanings! You can still get Tear Jerker's Sour Cotton Candy today, if you want to. It's sold by the Tootsie Candy Company. When you buy a package of Tear Jerkers, you'll be able to enjoy super sour grape and watermelon flavors. If you're of a certain age, indulging in this candy may trigger some sweet memories. Designed to mimic the taste of fairground cotton candy, Tear Jerkers also delivers intense sourness. This simulated candy floss is definitely loaded with flavor, but it's also too sour for some people. If you're the type of person who loves eating warheads, heads and other very sour candies, and you've never tried tear jerkers, you should give it a shot. You'll get the candy floss vibe, plus a burst of sourness that may just jerk some tears. Why do you cry? This candy is a spun sugar product. It's tangy, tart, and delicious. When you buy it, you'll receive a package that includes two flavors. I want it. Now and later, taffy stays soft. So soft. Yet so hard. Taffy fans who enjoyed candy during the 90s may have adored now and later taffy chews. This candy is a little hard to chew at the start, but it does soften up to the perfect consistency and texture. It becomes very malleable. It's a taffy that stays soft, so you can enjoy it now and later. Get it? <laughs> I don't get it. This candy is still on the market, so there's no reason not to enjoy it today. Now and Later is a candy product that was launched way back in the early 60s by a business called The Phoenix Company. At that time, it sold for just a nickel. This was a year-round taffy, as opposed to salt water taffy, which was then a summertime candy. Now and Later taffy became very popular with consumers. There are currently a dozen fruity flavors available, including tropical lemonade, strawberry, strawberry, blue raspberry, and original. This candy is now made by the Ferrera Candy Company. While you're free to eat it now and later, you may find that you gobble it up right away. Not now. Maybe later. Astro Pops have space age appeal. Impossible. Astro Pops are 1.5 ounce lollipops with space age shapes. They were launched during the early 60s by a couple of space program scientists who made the decision to switch lanes in their careers. Instead of helping the space program, they would help kids by creating yummy lollipops that resembled rockets. What do you think, you're some rocket scientist? The design of the suckers was based on the design of three stage rockets. The creators of Astro 
Astro Pops had lots of technical know-how, so they were able to create machines that efficiently produced these lollipops and their packaging. The wrapper for these candies actually functioned as the mold for the lollipops, and that was an innovative way to manufacture lollipops back in the 60s. The scientists would add hot candy to wrappers, plus paper sticks, which functioned as handles. While Astro Pops had a big fan base during the 90s, their roots go back to the space race days, when kids were fascinated by rockets. Astro Pops disappeared for a while, but they're around today and available online and at some brick and mortar retailers. These unique lollipops are total classics, which are loaded with retro appeal. To enjoy a blast from the past, treat yourself to an Astro Pop today. Failure is not an option. Runts. I said runt. Did you get your proper dose of fruit for the day? A banana? Perhaps a green apple? Ah, uh, back in the day, we were able to have many, many fruit servings with just one handful of runts. In your palm, you could have strawberries and grapes and oranges and watermelons. They may not have been actual fruit, giving us actual health benefits, but boy, were they grand. There were many different kinds and varieties. They had a specific break point when you bit down, or perhaps you sucked on them. What kind of runts eater were you? Can you remember? Runts were discontinued in… wait, were they discontinued? Now this is a hot topic. Of course. Freaking hot topic. That explains everything. Some sources say yes. Others say certain flavors were discontinued. Either way, runs clearly do not have the power and the clout they once did. Betcha a million dollars that if you went into a grade school and asked the first or second grade class if they knew what runs were, that they would not. Hey, try any grade in the whole grade school. Still betcha that not one child would know. You kids don't know what you want. That's why you're still kids, cause you're stupid. Fun Dip remains popular today. Now where's Lloyd with our Fun Dip? Fun Dip will be an awesome choice if you like candy that's tangy and fruity. It's made without artificial flavors, and it consists of fruity candy powder and a candy stick. With Fun Dip, which was definitely popular during the 90s, you dip the stick into the candy powder and then enjoy the powder. The stick is like a sweet lollipop with candy powder on the end. Maybe I've had too much. What do you think? Some people can't resist eating the candy sticks before the powder is gone, but most people are able to wait to consume their candy sticks. They want to get all the powder out of the colorful pouches first. Fun Dip has been around since the 40s. It used to be known as Lickamade. Since Fun Dip isn't discontinued, you should be able to find it easily. It's sweet with a touch of sourness that makes it fun to eat. Double dipped? What, what, what are you talking about? Have fun and dip into more of our great videos. Just tap that screen. And if you're new to our channel, show us some love. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to join our notification squad.